and I say, hey, yeah, 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 hey, oh, 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 hello, guys, um, I didn't, I didn't see you there, uh, yeah, it's just been 12 days and 12 nights as I've been waiting here, and it looks like it's finally daytime. I am back, recording another episode of Minecraft. Oh my god, another video, in two days in a row. Whoa, John must really be stepping it up. Hey, 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 shut up with your comments. I mean, I, I, that, I mean, uh, comment because that, that's what I want. But the, the people, you, you know, you know what I mean. Uh, we got, we still got uh, the donkey who shall not be over there, and um, we seriously need to find a name for him. I'm, I know I'm not gonna get any names in the comments because, well, no, none of people watch my videos to comment regularly. Regularly, la, 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 I can't speak to comment uh, when I tell them to or at least ask them to in a video so I probably won't be getting any names anytime soon however there's a second donkey over here right next to the sheep they okay, will just move out of the way kindly um, we need to name this donkey actually yeah we can name this one too if you want but um for the most part we're just gonna try and name that one that that okay which one to use the real donkey I think it's that guy so this guy can just go sit in the lake and um so yeah uh well yay my skin loaded let's do this uh, kinda of predictable for my skin alright let's go so last time I only had some time to set up and uh, try and survive the night. Unfortunately, that failed, so I had to go dig into the rock over there. But now that the first night had gone, I think I'd be to say that we could start establishing, or well, I could, because you guys aren't doing anything with this right now. Um, that we could start establishing a mine setup, so we could start getting some ores. Now, what I like to do, I'm not sure if you guys like to do now, because I'm like this, and I need, I, it's, it's like, sort of, I like to call it an OCD thing, but it's not really OCD. I like to keep my, uh, tools that are lessened, like the wooden pickaxe, under the stone, and use it whenever I can until it breaks and switch to the stone. It's a weird thing for me, and I know you guys will probably hate it in the comments, like, oh, John, use that one, and then burn your wooden tool or something, or throw it out. But, I'm not really like that. I don't think I like waste, and so, yeah. Uh, just mine. Oh, um, now I'm not sure if the game sound will be transferring because that's something I picked up last time that didn't work. The uh, game sound wasn't really transferring that well. And I don't even think it transferred at all. So, that's a bad thing. But whenever you hear me go oh or like something like that. Um, that's because I've, I've heard a noise that scared me, or maybe like a zombie nearby. So, just a little bit something more for you guys to, um, predict me with. And, uh, so, it's getting kind of dark here, and I do have my brightness turned up on bright, because I hate it. Ever since the, uh, I think it was 1.8 that made it, that made, uh, the lighting a little bit more realistic. I always hated that. My reason being because it always got too dark in places it shouldn't be too dark. So, I just turned it up on the bright, and there we go. Oh, there we go. Okay, I, I hear something, because uh, again, you guys probably can't hear it, but I hear something walking across on the stone somewhere. So, because of that, I'm going to be careful, and hopefully... I could find the dungeon if there is one nearby. I mean, suspecting there's a huge flat wall, but hopefully there is a dungeon. But, um, it can't be safe, safe sure. Um, if you hit F3, it used to show you the, uh, item code above the monster's name, so you could easily find spawners and see whatever's above you. The only problem is he took that out. Mojang taking things out. What are they doing? Um, I, pr I actually liked the game better back in the old days, when back before horses and new stuff and upgrades and building and, um, 
Well, I shouldn't say building because that's what the normal game was. The normal, the I, I, again, I say normal game, but I mean the like the beginning of the game. Okay, these um, zombie groans and skeleton bone thing sounds are getting really loud, so I'm gonna get close soon. But um, like I'm saying, uh, actually, you know what? I'll finish this story later. I have got all my stuff that I need. Uh, just plop in my torches. I have got my stone for my furnace. And it's almost night, so hopefully I can sleep before the things start, start spawning. But, um, so anyway, as I was saying, before the food and XP, you had your health and armor. And for those of you who have, who have just started getting in the Minecraft via the Xbox version, because it's just on your Xbox and your board, so you got it, or the ones that actually genuinely want to try out the game, but have only been able to try it out in this stage of it, because, you know, that's the stage it's in, you guys are really missing out because I because it was just go around and try and survive instead of oh hey you got food good luck or um, you got experience level up your stuff or boss battle go it's it was really just um, go go around and uh, generally try and survive build what you want and uh, other stuff like that yeah ow oh my food's going out of course, of course it is. Place down my furnace there, and we can cook some porkies, bacon. And it's done. First food, noms. Arrow can go here. Actually, yeah, I guess the arrow can go. Actually, no. No, we'll leave it blank for now, because that's where the food go. Actually, uh, ooh, they're sad. Get the rest of this pork, and bop. Set down a torch right here, because why not? Can cannot set them on? I did not know you could do that. Another th surprising thing, and look at that island over there. It's a pretty weird island. Look like you can kind of see it in the distance, cause, cause of how these games work, where the corners have more viewing distance. But yeah, so I'm gonna start planting my farm, but I don't have any seeds on me at least. Pretty smart of me. You know, go out and plant a farm, but you don't have anything to plant. That's pretty smart. Yeah, if you ask me. Now I just gotta sort of avoid the squid mafia over here, and I w I'm not gonna decimate this beach because that's a pretty cool little thing. And uh, build a little farm. Now again, guys, sorry for the lag. I can't really. And I'm on a dirt, guys. So that's the end of my farm. But um. Yeah, I'm sorry for the lag, I can't really control it, it's just my computer isn't really the it works, but it isn't really the best, because um, I've been growing up with, well I say it works because I've been growing up with laggy computers, I mean I had dial up for about 8 years of my life, and it kind of sucked, um, and the dial up was on one of those old 80's computers, instead of just having a laptop or what you guys would call a normal computer. Why are there so many donkeys over here? But, um, instead of having, like, what you guys look, look at today as a normal computer, having, like, the flat, sort of... Oh, hey, they added a higher definition to the flowers. But, um, instead of having... I, I, I keep losing myself here. Instead of having the, um... Uh, the higher, like, the flatter and just a little bit bigger screen, um... They, it was just a box, and that box was horrible. Um, so as I'm telling this story, I'm just going to lay out the foundations of my house here. Um, it was horrible, and with the dial-up, it stunk so bad. Um, it always ran slow, no matter what, because um, it, cause it always got dusty inside the, uh, whatever it's called, the thingy-mabobber that's not the monitor. Whoa, he doesn't know anything, everything about computers. What is this? Um, 
So yeah, I've grown up with laggy computers and horrible computers my whole life, so this is really not affecting me that much. Um, I've lear I've sort of learned to deal with it, but my sister, however, if she experiences this much lag, she'd go crazy, she'd flip out, and she'd be like, why isn't someone na 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 lag? And I'd just be like, learn to deal with it. But, um, so yeah, it's okay for me, but for, for you guys it might not be okay for, but at least the series is going, I mean, right? Yeah. Oh shoot, I didn't look at my timer to, to see how long I've been recording for, so I guess I'm going to have to uh, blind shot this one. So this is about how big my house is going to be. Please tell me if it still floats. Yeah, it still float. Seems like a good uh, plot for my house. And now we build. So I'm thinking of cobblestone floors, but if you guys have any better suggestions, post them in the comments below. Um, obviously by the time you see this, and it'll probably be a little later if I do get famous, so if you're watching this and it's not in the year 2014 or in the month of February, don't even bother posting a comment because this video is old. However, if you are watching now, one of my six subscribers, shout out to you guys by the way, uh, <laughs> uh, just post a comment telling me what floors to have. I've been considering of taking it out and making it stone or maybe replacing a big chunk of, of it with wool to make a carpet. Or maybe just building a carpet block. I don't know what they added to this update. But um, the walls are definitely going to be, be made out of wood. Stop being placed on the floor like that. Um, but yeah, the, they're gonna be made out of wood, so uh, no question about that. I'm kind of questioning the roof design, maybe the outside design. Um, maybe I should have some pillars of the wood blocks instead of just the wooden planks. I don't really know. This house is just gonna have to shape itself, and I have no idea what to name it. Maybe it should just be called my house. Maybe I should give it a specific name. Who knows? But, if anything, it's going to be a pretty awesome name. If we're going to name it. Because that's how this works. If you don't got a good name, you better get out from my channel. <laughs> um, but, uh... Yeah, so I'm going to have to get those flowers. And I might have to get this coal. The flowers because, um... I... I Okay, I don't have an excuse for the flowers. But for the coal, I definitely do. Because I need it for stuff. And that seems like a good enough excuse for me. Also, experience points. Ow, my legs. Um, so, yeah, this is really going uh, great. I really wish I had more topics to talk about so you guys aren't just sitting there bored knowing not nothing to do because you're bored um, but for now I'm just gonna keep digging out the mine and uh, hopefully we can get things going from there oh uh whoop, did I break that tour no I didn't um, I found a topic uh, plasma arc gasification um, it may already be being used by the time this video if this video gets popular by the time that happens or, but or not. But uh, right now, it's getting a lot of attention from scientists, and um, basically, people are the scientists. These couple of science, I forgot scientists. Uh, I forgot their names, but they found out a way to take anything and like anything that exists and turn it into a uh, a gas that can be used for energy. I'm not sure if they burn the energy, like burn the gas, like it's a flammable gas. Like, not gasoline gas, but like a flammable gas, like, um, methane. Like, methane gas, or, uh, something like that. But, uh, all I know is that it can be used for energy. And so, because of that, um, we could, we could take anything from a landfill, take any sort of nuclear waste just sitting down in the world, 
we could take that and change it take we could um take it apart molecule by molecule then reform it into a gas state again I have no idea how it works but it's been going around and it's definitely not fake because there have been many articles and many interviews with the guys who did it now I don't know how like I said but they t turn it into a gas by I guess rearranging, rearranging the molecules in it but um anyway my point is saving the environment um crap saving the environment by uh not making by not making any pollution while doing so by the way um not filling up landfills and definitely not putting any more nuclear waste into the ground to radiate it but instead we get a uh environment friendly totally pollution free i'm guessing not that expensive um uh i'm not that expensive um, alternative than just, to just throwing it inside of a landfill for the for like 60 years but um, so yeah I'm really hoping for that uh, I mean just imagine that you're walking around and instead of having recycling bins they'll just have like our gas like um, these bins made specifically for it Okay, I'm not going to get too nerdy on you guys, even though it probably already has happened. And, um... Oh, John, you just wasted all your stone on picks! Uh, well, I don't really care, to be honest. One, two, sleepy. Uh, I, I love that you could talk to yourself in this. Really for the people who don't have friends, so they could talk to themselves, you know. But, um, I'm really thinking, starting to think that I'm hitting the mark on how long my video is. I mean, last time, I made a 42-minute video, and, uh, that wasn't really something that I wanted to do, even though I do like making the long videos. Um, it does actually take up some of my time, and it, I guess it would take up your time, too, because since I'm not that popular, I don't have that much of a fan base to know really what's going on, to get suggestions of what I should talk about for my fans. And because I'm, you know, I'm just like a 13 year old boy, or guy, I'd, I'd rather prefer, um, I'm not that, uh, up to par with going on, like, watching the news. That, is, that doesn't really, really interest me. So, um, yeah, I'm thinking I'm gonna end it soon. Yes, I am my sister that's talking to me. Hopefully, you could hear her. Oh, um, what's up? What's up? So, um, yeah. Uh, I'm really, I'm starting to think I should end it soon. And I am getting weird, creepy noises, uh, like the random the ones you get in the caves. And, um, so if I started at 524... 532 minus 524. Ah, uh, math. Uh, uh, 522. 532 minus 524 would be somewhere around 10 minutes, I'd know. So, I'm gonna have to end it soon. Ooh, iron. Okay, I'll, uh, I'll end it when I once I uh, collect all this iron, go back upstairs and smelt it. That sounds like a reasonable thing to do. Yeah. It's actually not been lagging as bad as it was in the beginning. That's another good sign. But some iron ore, yeah. Maybe I can get myself some shoes or upgrade my pick. But I'm not gonna. But really, I'm not gonna do that until I start getting lower down into the ground. So I'm gonna put this into the stove. Um or furnace as most people call it cook it and then as that's cooking I'm gonna fill up the rest of my foundations and then I'm gonna have to end it there guys yeah uh, thank you for watching through this video and um cause I mean really who would I wouldn't really cause it's kinda boring at the moment um, but maybe later on, who knows what the future has in store for us. Uh, I, I was thinking of doing some Kerbal Space Program where there's always instant action around the game. But, um... 
again, the only problem is that I, it, it lags and my computer can barely run it as it is, let, let alone with the uh, recording software on. So, I leave you at that. Uh, 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 I leave you at that. And, uh, I am to Jimmy Jimmy, also known as John. And, goodbye. Cook pork. Uh.